Luckily, this was a good game, and we're going to follow it up with another good game, actually. Sonic Spike? No, it's a Summer Assault first. Oh. Hope that Sonic Spike was a beach volleyball game with the Sonic characters. Might be, might be. We'll see in a while. But uh, let's have a look then at Summer Assault. Now, this is not Summer, but Somer, as in Sumeria, because... Japan is weird. It is also an Atlas game. Hmm. Now, I have actually seen this played. And it is a pretty rad idea. This seems a bit loud to me. Yeah. Let's see. Mom. Uh, How you know when my birthday is, everyone? And yes, Frank Kermatic played this. It was one of three mystery games he was given by a friend to play for his, uh, was it his one year anniversary of the, uh, his, uh, old games special? I can't quite remember. Whoa. That is loud as hell. Jeez, game. Sorry for pausing there, everyone. Just bringing the volume down to something that doesn't smash the ears of everyone watching the YouTube videos later. Well, this woman is clearly evil. Yes. I can tell by her garish head ornaments. Also the fact that she is wearing a ring on her middle finger and no other fingers. Also, she can summon scorpions, apparently. She can actually summon the, uh, 12 signs of the zodiac. That, uh, that is literally the plot. And then, a slinky attacks. <laughs> Yes, Elliot, we are in fact a purple slinky. And that is our entire introduction to the uh, main character. He is a slinky that appears out of nowhere. Hmm. And as a slinky, we have interesting abilities in the fact that we can... Well... Attached to things. Whee. <laughs> this is odd. Whee. Okay, apparently, gr gravity still doesn't work. Yep, and the funny thing is that we need to be close enough to a different thing to attach to before we are actually allowed to let go. Ow. So we can't just jump into the darkness or anything like that. We actually have to know where we will be landing. Whoa! Big move, game. Please let me know where those damn things are. Oh, come on. Don't run away from me, power-up. Come back here. There we go. No idea what it did, but uh... Oh. Ow. The problem is that the controls change depending on where you are, so going up a corner, you can't just hold left, you have to pass the corner, and then press up, and then left, and then up, and so on. Okay, now we're faster, apparently this is supposed to help us somehow. The only thing it's doing is making me confused. Alright, boss time. First up is, uh, not unsurprisingly, Taurus. Mm -hmm. Who seems to be content hiding in a corner. Sure. We only have 60 seconds left. 
Thank you, game. Now that's one bull-headed boss. And I ran straight into it like an idiot. Wow. We have two slinkies left. Only two slinkies remain. Could you please just give up already? Hey, that went straight through the damn thing. Big nose. I shoot you, you go down! Ah, <laughs> Screw everyone born under the Taurus sign! Moving on. Whoa. Now we need to learn how to handle and master extending platforms. We also get a triple shot, which is useless if we're not in a boss area. Ah, oh, I love it. Attack slinkies! Let's see what's there. your birthday does not change the order of the bosses, what I know of. It may make the uh, given boss harder or easier, I have no idea. Actually, you would have to check that in game bags because I have no idea. Man, I really want to get all these ni nice power-ups. Damn it. I want to know what they do. I'm not entirely sure why I'm killing chest pieces though. Are chess pieces related to the Zodiac somehow? I, know, I doubt it. Yeah, I, I I don't know. I don't think so. I have never heard of it at least. Let's just slink our way up here. So far this level has been pretty uneventful. Which means at the moment I say that something horrible is going to happen. All these horses, what the hell? Ah, oh, here we go, that's more like it. Oh, they're actually stopping properly. Whoa! Yeah, I sped up quite a bit there. Oh, hey! Increased maximum health! Thank you. You're welcome. Oh. <laughs> I actually have to make it all the way back to the starting point around and walk up, don't I? Mm-hmm. Wow. Wow. Okay, fine. Has to run over there. <laughs> go, Slinky, go! I am the slinkiest. <laughs> do -do -do -do. Poor bastard who doesn't actually get a speed up boost when he's playing the stage, seriously. God damn it, how much further is it? It is literally back to the start of the level, are they serious? I mean sure there are time pickups, but what if you don't get one? does not bode well for anyone. Oh, here we are. And time over. Wonderful. Which relieves me of all my power-ups just in time for taking the step into the boss. Laser beam firing 
four. Alright. Perks, I guess. Not what, exactly what I would, you know, expect, but yeah, sure. I wonder if it actually is a safe position to have. That's a little bit nice. Whoa. The lay on that is instantaneous. I'm not entirely sure what you're supposed to do when that those blocks actually come somewhere where you're headed since you can't see them before they do and well you know see them. Of course I want to continue. Come on. This is an awesome game. Oh, I have to start a level over. Are you serious? Crap. Maybe if I go to on the side this time. You know, in the vein of Atlas games, this is pretty much on par with their weirdness. Yeah. But it's good though, and I mean, yeah. that's what Atlas does. Weird with good games. I can respect that, really. Let's see, oh hey! What does it mean? Oh no, wait, I'm supposed to go there. Yeah, pew 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 Hopefully this will end up being quite a bit shorter now that I actually know where I am supposed to go. Yeah. It literally took 153 seconds shorter time to get where I was supposed to go this time. Wow. Let's see, this space is... Laser safe? The question is whether it's rock safe. Most likely not, but uh. Ow. I love your face. Yeah, that the horrified facial expression the Slinky does when it's hit. I mean, that means that apparently the Slinky has eyes hidden somewhere. Exactly where? I have no idea. this. I hide behind you! No. Nope. Ow. <laughs> That'd be a new. That didn't work out at all. No. Maybe if I'd position myself in the corner. Ah, I'm s actually safe from the lasers here and I can fire at him a whole lot. The question is, yeah, we'll get rocks in the head. Not escape the rocks. Ha. No one can defeat the corner killer. Uh, that that means I kill from corners, not that I, you know, kill corners because that that would be ridiculous. That'd be weird. Then again, if you're afraid of facing down the hounds of Tindalas, I suppose you could kill corners. Or if you're working for a Corporation that isn't having a hard time making ends meet, you can cut corners. Badoom. Thank you, we'll be here all night. By the looks of it, we will. Ow. Well, that didn't go even as well as I would have hoped. Stop shooting me. And it turns out that there's nothing here, so it was completely useless to go here in the first place. Wow. Thanks a lot, game. And they respawn. I 
have to spawn chasing enemies right behind me, really? Give me a break. Huh, about this time. And that's a new entry. Nice. This one is a skull. I wonder what that does. Oh, <laughs> yep. That's like As I thought. Instant death. So, so what does the souls. chat think of this? I don't think they've said much, probably because they don't have much to commentate on. They're confused. Yes, it's uh, been pretty quiet from the chat's direction. I'm not sure if it's because they like the game or because they think it's horrible. They're confused. Confusion is another emotion that may be involved, yes. Right, let's see. Yeah, I suppose. It's an Atlas game, enough said. Good, but quirky. Mm-hmm. 